Hi guys, and today on Shoppers for Life, episode number 26, we're going to be making some uh, everything off-season bagel shoppers today. So what you need for this is one egg, a fourth of a cup of cheese, any cheese of your choice, a fourth of a teaspoon of uh, garlic, two tablespoons of almond flour, and uh, one egg, and that's pretty much it. You just mix it all in together, and any really seasonings of your ta choice, and any uh, cheese of your choice. So what we did over here, we had two sausages left over and we just kind of like sliced them all up and we mixed them all in the measuring cup. And then over here in the uh, overall uh, ingredients is I put them in one bowl, mixed it up a little bit, and then I just dumped in the uh, sausages sliced up and then I mixed it up with the, my fork. And then once I got the uh, mini dash going, I put them on top and then I didn't really need to spray it, but I wanted these to be a little crunchy. So I added a little bit of cheddar cheese on the top of it. Uh, each of the shaffles and then after about uh, a couple of minutes later I had the really really good tasting uh, shaffle with some sausage in the middle and then what I did for it for the snack there for the uh, that I, I cut them in half and then I put them in a bowl and then I got the extra sausages that I had put in the, on the side of the bowl for a uh, you know for the snack for the late night snack like about four or five o'clock when I'm hungry and uh, Typically, uh, that's usually what goes on with me. So then they had just put the uh, so extra uh, cheese on the top to make it a little more crunchy. And then there you have the uh, how they came out. And that was the uh, first shaffle. And then it, again, yeah, I didn't even need to spray it because it had a lot of grease in it from the uh, sausages. But I get a lot of these inspirations from just uh, Jason Moore over there in his YouTube channel. And I'm, I'll have the link above the timeline and below the uh, show more. He makes a lot of shaffle recipes, and then I'm always searching for different ideas and techniques. Uh, one of the ideas I got from him was the uh, ground beef one that he had put together there. And they said, well, if it works for ground beef, it should work with sausage. So, you know, when I make up some more ground beef again, then when I'm doing a beef and butter fast there, I'll, uh, you know, save a little bit of ground beef, and I'll do one like, kind of like similar what he did and uh, see if I can uh, duplicate his texture that he got. And these came out nice and crunchy and real, really good. So again, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. And the rest of it's basically simple. And then we'll just uh, go on and uh, finish up with the video. And from this point on, it'll be just music. And uh, have a great day. And don't forget to go over to support uh, Jason's channel as well as mine and many others that I got in the uh, show more. Have a great day, guys.